God's truth. I was inhuman. I didn't listen to my friend. I listened to my enemy. So when I captured the enemy from the other side, when I read in his blue eyes the screams his mouth can't sling into the skies of war, when his open belly has become nothing more than a pulp of raw flesh, I turn back the clock. I finish off the enemy. As soon as he's made a second plea with his eyes, I slit his throat like a sacrificial lamb. What I didn't do from Edemba the up, I do for my blue-eyed enemy out of my reclaimed humanity. When I crawl home, slipping under barbed wire between wooden posts rising from the viscous mud, when I come home to our trench that's spread open like a woman face in the sky, I'm covered with the blood of the enemy from the other side. I'm like a statue made of mud and blood mixed together and I stink so badly even the rats flee. My stench is the stench of death. Death is the stench of the decomposed inside of the body and even the rats are afraid when they smell me coming. Crawling beneath the barbed wire. They dread the sight of death moving, advancing towards them, so they flee. They flee at home in the trench too. Even after I've washed my body and my clothes. Even when I think I've purified myself. <laughs>